bbccas.com I'm with the lovely Philippa Souza representing Portugal this year. Lovely to meet you again. We met last week in Amsterdam, but we didn't get a great amount of time with you. It was a great conclusion. <laughs> yeah, it was very busy. Yeah. Yeah. And so tell me, how was it that you actually decided to enter the castings for the national research contest this year? And what aim did you have in mind? Uh, I've been trying for several years uh, because uh, they had different uh, process. Yeah. Yeah. The previous years, they had a, we can make a, a song and then send it and they choose the song. So this year they made a casting for the singers and then they invited some Portuguese comp composers, uh, not the case of Andre Babich, who is a, a famous composer already from our festival. Uh, so I went to the casting, I was chosen and then they gave me one of the composers that was uh, initially was uh, Fado Singer. Composer, yes. a singer. Yeah. Uh, he had to withdraw to yeah. because of professional reasons. Yeah. And then they invited uh, Carlos Coelho and Andrei Babich. <laughs> so, have you taken any part in any music contests before? And how do you feel about the competition aspect of it in general? I don't know. This uh, this is different because you are uh, representing. Not this is not only about your voice. Yeah. Uh, this is a song festival. Yeah. It doesn't matter if you. Of course, it matters. It doesn't matter if you sing well or not. But uh, the most important is to have the whole uh, the whole thing: the music, the lyric, the voice, the, the performance on stage. Yeah. So. And what are your expectations from Baku? How do you think you're going to do? I'm going to the final. <laughs> yes, I know it, we are in a difficult semi-final, but we are confident. <laughs> cool. And um, have you heard any of the other songs that are participating this year? Have you got yes. any favourites so far? I think the Spanish songs. Yes. Are really excellent. Yes. <laughs> so. Um, before I listened, the first time I heard all the songs, um, the one that I got in my ear was uh, the song from. Uh, Sweden. Yeah. A song from Lorraine. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a great song. Yeah, it's a great song and the performance on stage is uh, it's amazing. It's a great, a great thing. But now my favorite is definitely Gustora Soleil. She yeah. has a great voice, the music. It's a very difficult song. It's beautiful, the message. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. My vote goes for Spain. Not nothing to do with with the fact that yeah, we yeah, are neighbors. Yeah, it's a great time. And yeah. after after Baku is all over, what are your plans? Do you do you have new material coming out? Are you planning an album release? Give me yeah. some um, things on that. I think since I was a young child, so yeah. I guess yeah, I want to to have a CD someday. But uh, as I as I say, I sing lots of songs of uh, different styles, yeah. and I don't want to make a CD just to say I. So what are so, your personal favorite styles? What styles do you like the most? I like to sing rock, I like to sing yeah. follow, I like to really? sing rock folk <laughs> ballads. No, no, so maybe I'll do something, uh, a mix with the fado and traditional songs, uh, something uh, related to the world music. Uh, but I also have different styles. Uh, for example, now I try to with two DJs, yeah. they invited me, it's a, a completely different style, yeah. it's gonna be out um, on 23rd May I guess, so it's gonna be a great month, <laughs> we have the teaser next week coming, and then the video clip, and we have lots of dates this summer, it's called Sunset Lovers, okay. so <laughs> if you want then <laughs> we <will download> just <laughs> have a look. <laughs> okay, and you've been performing a lot of Fado songs over the years, what's your personal favourite? And maybe we can get you just to sing a little bit of it as well. Of Fado? Yeah. Yeah, I started singing, fa singing Fado after uh, Amalia, Amalia's yeah. death. Yeah. So, of course, she's a great diva. Yeah. She's the best one. Yeah. But uh, then I was influenced by Marisa and yeah. uh, Namora. Mafalda, no, we have now lots of different uh, different fado singers with new styles. Yeah. So your personal favorite? My personal favorite. Uh, <laughs> I don't have a favorite one. I, I like different singers, so 
And, and just finally, we're going to put you on the spot and we're going to get you to sing a little small part of your Eurovision song if that's okay with you. Yeah. I know you've been sign checking and I know you're busy, but just whenever you're yeah, ready. Yeah, just like two hours. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just I can do ready. it, I can do it. I've been doing it in the middle of the street. Okay, so okay cool. Whenever you're ready. Okay. Se fosses luz, amor, ai luz do dia, sorriso inspirador da fantasia, se fosses água, amor, qual água pura, que mata a seda a flor da ternura. Excellent, thank you very much. We're gonna we're gonna meet with you again in Baku, which is I think in about yes. ten days time or something ridiculous. Oh, really tell me about that. <laughs> it's not long now, and, and yeah, we're looking forward to chatting with you. Yeah, we're going on thirteen. Yeah, well, I think we're there from the tenth of May or something stupid. So. Yeah, we're going on thirteen to Paris, and then fourteen we arrive in Baku. So. Yeah, okay, we'll see so you there. We'll see you there. Our first rehearsal on fifteen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you.